Uh, the suspect of the controversial killing of Edwin Shiloba has confessed killing him because of cheating. According to Langa's OCPD, John Odhiambo, Jackton executed the murder with the help of his two friends who are still at large. Odhiambo, who had been staying with the deceased for a period of one year in Eldoret, was arrested on Friday as the main suspect in the murder. Jackton Odhiambo, the main suspect in the murder of fashionista Edwin Shiloba, has confessed to killing the model over allegations that he cheated on him. According to the Langa, OCPD John Odhiambo, Jackson executed the murder with the help of his two friends who are still at large. The suspect said he murdered Chiloba as revenge for betraying him. Odhiambo, who has been staying with the deceased for a period of one year in Eldoret, was arrested on Friday as the main suspect in the murder. The two lived together as husband and wife. Chiloba's caretaker Alex Nyamoya said that Odhiambo called him using Chiloba's phone on January 4th, informing him that he was vacating at the house they lived in. And true to his words, Odhiambo vacated the house with immediate effect. The police are investigating a possible love triangle after the main suspect, Jackson Odhiambo, finding out Chiloba had another partner. Chiloba's body was discovered in a metallic box on Kipenyo Katinga Road in Wasinigishu County by Boda Boda riders who saw an unmarked vehicle dumping the box on the side of the road. Police are also looking for the vehicle used to ferry and dump the body. mambo na mabishi ama mtu wa mtu wa ugomvi no eh ni mtu alikuwa tu na heshima zake this house has since remained empty after jackton relocated on the 4th of this month nyamoya tells us that the suspect informed him through a phone call made using the late chilobas damba nikapata call kuangalia call yangu nikapata ni from eh, chiloba okay kuichukua hiyo call eh sauti haikuwa ya chiloba ilikuwa ni ya huyo ndugu yake ambaye wanaishi pamoja akaniambia kuwa anahama eh nikamwambia okay akaniambia kuwa anahama na alikuwa anataka kifungu ya main gate ndio nikamwambia nilikuwa mbali kidogo aningoje baka labda mwanda wa saa 8 ndio niweze kumletea so after that ndio nikamletea kifungu eh akaweza ku I have a lot to achieve, uh, to build my brand and also to inspire people to be just the best fashion of themselves. Like I really love to see people just doing themselves and doing what they love, spreading love and just being themselves. That's my my uh, my really happiness. Yeah. yeah. Okay, uh what is uh a lot of people are trying to get into the fashion industry and all that uh modeling to we, we realize you're doing both of them so what advice would you give to any of the upcoming or people who are looking into doing such stuff in the industry coming next year what are the we see you you're doing an amazing job how do i really want to be a model i really want to be a fashion designer what can i do i just my advice to them is just just keep doing them like don't copy don't compete with anyone just be that authentic self when nothing like being authentic whatever you feel inside you do that thing no never care about what other people will say their opinions because no matter what you do in this world people gonna talk so just keep doing you and be yourself well <laughs> happy new year to you edwin happy new year bye bye uh -huh, well yeah i well uh edwin we saw a lot of things this year from you uh, especially on instagram your projects what are some of the major projects that you're proud of throughout the year Wow, that is something major, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, well, how are you so far? I'm good. You're good, you're sure? <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, well, uh, it's been a very tough year, the elections and all that. But, well, let us know, what are the most influential people or people who you met, close friends who have actually changed things that you used to do and see them in a different way? 
Oh, first of all, uh, uh, I've met a lot of people this year. They spread love, like, when you're in space, they just love your energy. Um, the people that I've met are, like, Michelle Talami, oh, Talami, friend, Venom, you know, wow. Nick, Nenda. Like, they have taught me in a way that, uh, to see life in a different way, perspective, and also the way I do my things. What I about me? Yeah, you too. <laughs> <laughs> what about it? Yeah, you tell me like you I've learned a lot from you, mm. your heart and it has really inspired me to keep doing me a wow. lot. Okay, enough about us. Uh how what are some of the things that you had planned throughout the year and they didn't go as you wanted but you have learned something out of them, some of the failures or things that you wanted to do. What are the lessons that you've learned? Okay, uh, I've learned a lot from the failures and it has taught me that never give up on what you're doing and also to accept the mistake that you've done and just move on with life. You know, yeah, it has really inspired me, it has built me acceptance and just move on with life. Wow, that is some real good advice, safe from the heart, people. Uh -huh. uh, it's about uh, two days to 2023. What are some of the major things that you'd love to happen to you in the year? To come okay uh i have a lot i have a, a big dream uh to see my works being showcased maybe in new york and also to be that big fashion high gun you know i have a lot of things that i really want to achieve <laughs>
tu pago por